In this tutorial, we're gonna go through the Valentine's Day cards found on the shop. Um, basically, all these cards work the same. They're a four by six ratio. So you can deal with the uh, Happy Valentine's here in the horizontal, the vertical, the same vertical, but with to and from. Uh, this one with the more colorful hearts, uh, as well as the same one with the to and from. All of these templates work the same way, so I'm gonna walk you through how to, uh, how to do one of them, and then also show you why I've included a three box Facebook header uh, with this package as well. So I'll go through and, uh, and quickly go through one of these uh, vertical uh, examples if you're actually building it uh, from scratch, so dragging and dropping your images in. So if you click on wherever you've got your images imported into Photoshop and drag and drop these into your template. Now they're a little bit small, but that's okay. We'll fix that after. And we drag them in. And then what I'm gonna do is select all three of them. So you can see on the side here, I've selected all three. And I'm just gonna drag them down into under the folder that says your images under here. That just places them behind the actual card template. And so then what I'm gonna do is actually go through and individually now just resize those. So control T to transform, increase the size and roughly place it where it needs to go. I'm just gonna do this quickly. Obviously you can fine tune this. So control T to transform. And place my image. Same with the last one, control T, drag and drop, basically to fit it into the image. So very, very quickly, that's how um, these templates work. Everything on the right hand side here is where you need to customize anything if you want to. Um, you can turn off the, the child's name by quickly, quickly hiding that layer or opening it up. If you wanna edit that layer, uh, use your text on the left hand side, come down here and click and just edit the name out put it in as something else altogether. And so that's really all there is to all of these uh, Valentine's Day card templates. Um, now the reason I give you a three box Facebook header template uh, is to actually speed this uh, process up and also give your client um, something that they can display on, uh, on their Facebook page uh, as well. So show you quickly about that. So here's the three box Facebook header um, template. It works the exact same way with the layers on the right hand side. So you drag and drop your images in, put them under the folder that says your image is here and, uh, and size them just as I did before. Now, if I come back over here, this is actually a Facebook header that I had already done. So if you take your time and, and do this for your client first, um, doing the cards is actually very, very quick. So what I'll do is now that I've got this all finished, I'm gonna flatten my image. So go layer, flatten image. So it makes your image all one. All the layers are hidden now. They're all combined as one. Now take your selection tool and just slightly bigger than the grid itself. Um, go along and select this portion of your image. Now, using the move tool, um, grab that and drag it into the card that you're going to use. Obviously, if I'm doing a horizontal card, I'm gonna do a horizontal Facebook header. Um, if I'm doing a vertical card, I'm gonna deliver a vertical uh, three box for my clients. So now I'm simply going to resize this uh, to fit the, um, the template. And in this case, I actually want to keep it at the very, very top. I don't want to drag it down underneath here because it may add extra lines or, or that to the image. So I actually just want to keep it at the very, very top, have it on top of everything else. And once I'm happy with that, um, I can go ahead and 
edit uh, the to and the from if I want, or if I'm leaving that for them to fill in, I can. And same thing, I would go ahead and flatten this image. So image or layer, flatten image, makes it all one. And then I would export this uh, however I wish. So file, I usually file, export, export as. And when this comes up, it allows me to save my image uh, in whatever size I want. So uh, I keep it as a JPEG, 100% quality. I usually keep it at about this. So if, that's basically uh, the Valentine's Day cards and how to use the Facebook header um, to speed up your workflow for, for these. If you have any questions, feel free to uh, ask. And I'll, as always, uh, find me in the uh, White Box Photography Group. Thanks.